Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna install a CO2 conversion kit for the Lancer Tactical LT20 sniper rifle. Um, this is the kit. This is the conversion kit. So yeah, let's install it. I have no clue how to do it, so this is gonna be fun. A lot of you have been waiting for this video, so yeah. What you need to do is you're gonna, you need to pull these pins out. One in the back and a small one in the front. Let me first take the scope off. Need to jiggle it a little bit. There it comes, there it comes, yes. Come on, baby. And there it is. And now you can see the internals. Let me grab the camera. So, what you need to do is it's quite hard to get it out. But you need to push this forward. Let me see. Oh, I haven't fired this rifle a lot, so. Yes. So, this is gonna come out. Yes, beautiful. And this is going to come out. And then, this is one that what's going to. So, I don't know if you can see it, but this and this part, we need to get them out. Okay? So, let's put them aside. You don't need this either so this let's put it away let's see this part you don't need this anymore so put it aside then put it on there and you've got your small spring and that's gonna fit over there This will fit in there, and then we'll do this. This little thing. Let me show you. It's gonna hold the CO2 cartridge like this. All you need to do is screw this piece on again, turn it really tight until it sits and that's it. This is going in there. I will show you without the CO2 cartridge. This will fit in there, just like this. Like 
so. Ta-da! And then, your recoil spring. Ta da And that's it. I mean, that's basically the complete installation of the CO2 conversion kit. I recommend keeping these parts if you want to convert it back. Just hold on to these and you can, yeah rebuild it to a spring powered rifle. Those are the main things you need to do. right there you've got your long one in the back put that back in and if I'm not mistaken this is it this is the complete conversion from spring to CO2 it's quite an easy job like you see I haven't done it before it was completely new for me so I did it in about five to ten minutes so let's see if it cocks. Yep, like a charm. Well, that's it. And now I will show you how to put in a new C2 cartridge. What you need to do is pull out those pins again, take off the top section, need to do is take out this spring again, the recoil spring, take out the canister and then you need to unscrew the cap, put in your CO2 cartridge and what you need to do is screw on this and now it's loaded it's gonna work slide in the conversion kits for the metal cylinder back in there slide the top cover back on put in the pins again and the pin in the front like this and you're done that's all you need to do Push back the bolt and that's it. I mean, you can hear it. It's it's 
It's packing a lot of punch. It's really a beast. Again, I mean, hear it. This is a beast. Put the scope back on. Just like this. And again, when you put in this CO2 uh, conversion kit, uh, the way you you, 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 you cock the bolt, it's very light. I mean, if you have the old system, the spring system, it's, it's hard to pull back the, the bolt, but with this CO2 conversion kit, it's, it's very light and very easy. It's, it's quite a, a good upgrade. The only small problem is when you want to need to put in a new uh, CO2 uh, so, uh, cartridge. Yeah, what you need to do is um, take the complete cover off and your recoil spring and then you can put in a new CO2 uh, cartridge. So that's quite unhandy. But yeah, I mean, listen to it. It's, it's, it's a damn beast. It's awesome. This is, uh, this is how you're gonna install the CO2 conversion kit. It's easy, it takes around, yeah, what I said, five until 10 minutes and you're completely done. So that's it. So everyone, this is the video about the uh, Lancer Tactical LT20 CO2 conversion kit. I hope you like it. I hope um, it's gonna help you to install uh, your own CO2 conversion kit if you want to. Yeah, I hope uh, you like this video. So subscribe to my YouTube channel for more um, awesome videos about airsoft guns and other useful information about Airsoft. And please leave a like on this video and I hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching. Just one time, just one time, just for the sound. Oh, it's beautiful.